Hey, 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 ladies and gents. Uh, it is Drew, also known as Random Planet. We had to go a different route here. Unfortunately, the character that was created before was not able to be saved. Um, so what I'm going to do is we are going to create a new character. Which we already did, as you can see, this is Carrie Henley. We are in the same world. And we are going to attempt to stay with this world. Um, this is going to be something a little bit different. I do not normally do this. I'm not willing to be able to give up on the Thousand Days Survived Challenge uh, because of an issue, you know, with the world itself. I don't know what time it is. I just realized that I do not have a watch. Um, I also do not know where are my skills? Oh my god. So the other thing that I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be restarting all my skills. I'm going to be restarting everything. That is going to be the quote-unquote rebirth of this situation. So... Oh. Apparently we have a chocolate chip cookie and a cinnamon roll. Which are fine, I guess. Um... Yeah. So therefore, this is going to be about trying to survive the apocalypse. Starting over in this person or in this situation. We'll take that duct tape. And unfortunately, things are going to get a little bit rough. Like, let's face it, they are not going to be easy. So what I'm going to do is we are going to, once again, attempt to be able to just get back to the base. This will be... Oh god, there's so many. Okay, I have no idea where I am even. Where am I? Oh shit. Um, yeah. This is... Oh my god. Okay. Alright, well, at least I was able to get some shoes. Alright, I think I know where I am. Um, we're not too far. Yeah, because that's the, the pawn shop. Yeah. Poor little thing. She is... Oh my god. Well, this is going to be a fun world because we are in Pit Stop. Unfortunately, we did loot... The characters still exist. It just cannot save. Which is incredibly it, it sucks it sucks so the easiest way to be able to say it is i can still pull up the character it stays in one area it does not save i can play with it for hours on end it goes back to, like if i log out it goes back to the situation that it was before oh my god this might not have been smart um yeah let's go through 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 oh my god this might be bad this might be bad this might be bad this might be bad go okay Ooh. okay um there is the base right there so i'm not too worried about it because we have things at the base it's as i said it's going to be starting to over God, there are so many zombies in this area. As I said, the only thing that's going to be start sucky is the fact that it's going to be starting over all those levels. I had, like, I could award those levels, but I think this is kind of the... Like, the sacrifice for keeping the world and restarting the Thousand Days Challenge. Um... Yep, so here we are. Oh, boy, this is going to suck. This is going to suck. Hardcore. Um, now, my question is, what do I have? We need some type of shotgun, which I do. Dude, I had, like, level 6 aiming, too. Oh, 
Oh, that sucks. Um, you know what? We're gonna grab this table. Oh crap! It doesn't have a magazine. Never mind. Shh, Nikes. Did that use a twelve gauge? Holy crap! It's automatic. All right, there's got to be something, right? You know what? Do I have? Oh, that does not sound fun. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and just grab whatever. Um, dash back mini with extended stock. I do not know if this is gonna help with anything. Uh, seven six two. Two three four five six seven eight nine ten. You know what? Let's open up all these boxes. It's seven six two. Oh shit, that's 76239, not 45 or 54. Damn it. I did not realize there was a difference. Um, fine. We have those as well. You know what? Screw you and the horse you rode in on. We have our bullets. We are going to use them. So, the one thing I'm glad about, these are different fences. I don't think they can get through those, right? Alright. did not work as well as I wanted it to. I did not realize that was fully automatic. I mean, we killed... Wow. We killed 15? You know what? Screw it. We are going to go balls deep on this character. Uh, Carrie Henley is going to kill 100,000 zombies. She is going to 100% kill 100,000 zombies. The one thing that I have to say about this is I did learn pretty specifically. that I need to save my game file. This takes forever. You know what? Oh, you can't fast forward reloads. Really weird. We have so many gazings. Oh my god, there's more over there. I need a shotgun. Dude, I need a shotgun. Are less than them, for sure. You know what? We're gonna have to take a look in the. Come on, be a shotgun in here, please. I think we're gonna use the tactical um stuff as well. Crap. Doesn't seem like there is. Does not seem like there is, and I do not think I have. There's Beretta, there's an Axe, Aimcast, which is basically the same thing as what I'm using. We need a different gun, though. 
And unfortunately, I did not bring all the different guns. Okay. That's a different gun. That's a 12 gauge. Um, 12 gauge. Do I only have two boxes of shotgun shells? Seriously? Okay. I'm just realizing the Amstel Striker shotgun is still. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. 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 Oh my god. It's gonna take forever today. But the aiming level is already up to one. If anything, this is gonna help me out with the guns. Alright, they are lesser, for sure. Oh, this kind of sucked because... Uh, I'm just so disappointed that this save did what it did. So many zombies. That's already 82 zombies killed. And two levels of aiming. Dear Lord, this is actually a pretty good shotgun. Or the first two levels of aiming are that easy. we gotten quiet? Have we gotten quiet? It seems like we've gotten quiet. Good. Dear Lord. Oh. You know what? We're going to equip those in both hands. I want to change the pirate mode to single. Like, I think the full auto was probably about too much. And then we will continue working on this stuff here. So, we do have this base. We do have the base in West Point. Unfortunately, this means that everything else is going to have to be restarted. All my levels, all everything is going to have to be restarted. Once again, this happened because of a save issue with the character that I have. So the character Drew Random that I have that was surviving the thousand days that has killed six thousand zombies that has been alive for sixty days literally spawns in every single time right here. So it's one hundred percent right here all the time. I can't do anything about it. It is literally not saving the character. It is not doing anything. I can play for a couple hours. It comes back to this point if I ever log out. So, no matter what I do, the save file is corrupted for Drew Random. So, we're literally starting over. We're going to see exactly what we're going to be able to do with this. I'm still planning on surviving a thousand days. It's probably going to be a little bit further in between episodes because, well, let's face it, I'm going to be playing catch up on this. Um, but we're going to consider this episode 13, Rebirth, um, and we are going to be playing as, as I said, Carrie Henley. Carrie Henley. Um, which should be interesting. It should be interesting. So, you know what? What we are going to do... Should I make this a guns-only character? <laughs> that would be... I don't have the weapons for that, now. Um... But what we're gonna what, look, we're gonna have to work on a lot of stuff. Oh my god! I just realized I don't even have a belt. I don't even have a belt. Um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna wear the SWAT stuff. Why not? Right? And 
so there's a ton of it. So you might as well, right? Alright, as you can see, she is fully kitted out now with SWAT stoof. Alright, let's eat this chocolate chip cookie. We have plenty of things to be able to go through. Unfortunately, all my books and everything else are up at West Point. I'm not going back to West Point with this character. It's, it's going to be a nightmare. So this is almost like starting over within this little area. I do have, you know, enough things that I think will keep me good. Um, we have food. We don't have a ton of food, but we have food. You think they're actually going to go away? I hope so. How long have I been up here? A little over six hours. Damn, I'm thirsty. The streets for uh, so, uh, I love these like radio type sections because they they help keep you uh, like occupied as everything is going on. So this is going to be a little bit on the crazy side. Um, what the hell was that noise? Take a little bit of screenshot here. Take a little bit of a screenshot here as we do our thing. <laughs> Alright, so there's going to be a little bit of a, like a movement issue with that. So I'm watching for the jerkiness as well. I don't know if the issue... Nope, because there it goes. But what we're going to do is we are going to run with this specific character. Um, hopefully we will be able to work on quite a few different things. It's going to be kind of a nightmare, honestly. Um, you know what I should do is I should also... Eh, do any of you have belts on you? Do any of you have belts on you? We do have a red digital watch. All right. So what I'm going to do is this is going to be kind of the starting of the series here to be able to do the rebirth. And it's not going to be a very long one. Like we're basically talking about what we're going to be doing going forward. My character, as you can see, there's, we started in West Point. We came down to, pit stop my plan is to eventually go into raven creek with this character um i still do want to do the 1000 zombies kill or 100,000 zombies killed um it's going to be a longer process i think it's going to be quite the longer process and we will uh you know we'll, we'll see as that comes that should be fun should be fun so let's get started All right, and we are back with everything that we need. I was able to at least get the items off of my other character. Um, so we're going to start over, in essence. Um, this is going to suck, but it's... You know, we have this base, we have everything else. It doesn't make sense to kind of mess around. We might as well just go ahead and... Cut our losses, realize that, well, you know, things are the way that they are, and just go ahead and continue the series. Realize that things do suck. <laughs> that hasn't. Um, now, my problem is, what I'm doing as a quote-unquote punishment is the fact that because I have... I had to create a new character because of the glitch with the mod on the old character. I'm leaving the levels as they are. I'm not giving those levels back to myself. We will say that the equipment that he gets, or that she gets, the base that she gets, the fact that we're able to continue the series is 
benefit enough, the punishment is going to be specifically, you know, just being able to do things. Um, let's see what we got here. You know, we'll just go ahead and take this one. Um, keep in mind, I cannot hotwire with her. Which is probably one of the biggest things that does annoy me is the fact that I am not able to hotwire with this character. Um, we need to be incredibly careful because I do not have the ability to be able to cut through large swaths of zombies like I did with my other character. So we shall see. We shall see. Um, you know what? Let's keep this open. I swear to God, every single time I hear that, it, it reminds me of a clicker. Which, I... Someone suggested that I do a Last of Us Steam themed, like, playthrough. I don't know if there are any mods that would allow that to happen. So if you guys know of any mods... Oh, shit. Okay, you are a slow swinger, ma'am. Dear lord. I'm guessing it's because... That is really slow swinging. Okay, that's something that I need to get adjusted to as well, is... This character does not have long blunt levels and does not have um how many and does not have many maintenance levels so things are going to break really quick and on top of that they are going to Whew. things are going to get rough things are going to get rough um dear lord why is that all the way over here Oh, because I was doing <laughs> a couple shorts earlier. Oh, I still have the striker shotgun on me. Hmm. Could do that. You know what I should do is I should play with a spear. The problem that the reason why I don't want to play with a spear right now is because I just don't have the maintenance levels. All right. You know what? I always wanted to try out one of these. <laughs> the Joker. I always want to try out one of these, uh, E tools. Because they seem like they'd be a pretty effective weapon. What do we have in here? Okay, tons of computers. That will come in handy with. What's this? Oh. What the hell? Oh, swing man. It's gonna get me killed eventually. Army wants to go with this. Yeah. Because we'll be able to. zombies around here. Is that a gym? Okay, that is a lot of zombies. And I, the other thing that I need to realize is I don't have desensitized. Maybe that's the reason why I'm swinging so slow. I don't have desensitized. Alright. So I'm panicking. Uh, I forgot how hard this was going to be in comparison to what I've been used to over the last couple of, uh, you know, weeks worth of game. What the hell type of weapon is that? An antique bayonet. Okay. We'll take the gas mask. Take the flashlight. We'll take the painkillers. We'll take the MBC gloves and boots. The passive vests. 
Dallas webbing. All right, come on, copper. All right, so there's going to be a lot of. Uh... Oh, dear lord. They just don't stop coming. All right. So I just need to keep on killing. That's the only choice I have is just going through and killing as much as possible. Keep in mind this character has only been alive for six hours in game. to desensitize as soon as possible, which is going to mean a lot of zombie killing. Hey, long blunt. There we go. That's good. That's two levels in long blunt. Alright, what we need to do is I need to grab everything that I don't need to use in there. I don't care about the drop like punch. I don't care about anything other than the shotgun and the spear, honestly. Alright, that should be good. What are those zombies doing? What are those zombies doing? Dear Lord. Um, so I do know that there is... Oh, shit. Not what I wanted to do. Alright, whatever. We're gonna do this. There's a lot of zombies. There's so many freaking zombies in this area, man. Alright. I don't know what that is. But we need to take out these groups of zombies because she will not have the strength to be able to get through a board if it gets too deep beginning here so is most definitely time to be able to go ham on lowering the zombie population here because we need to get up to desensitize ASAP. Oh shit. One behind us. Two behind us. Okay. Maybe we're gonna need to go through the Calvary Saber. Because the Calvary Saber is so much quicker. And we kinda need to get her maintenance level up as well. Sh Nikes. Okay. 30, 149 killed. Come on. Let's, uh... See, the thing is, these zombies are getting smarter as they go, which means they're gonna path after me. Way deep in. Saber. <laughs> I like this cavalry saber. That thing is gonna save my ass. Oh my god! Dude! Do I dare just... Go shotgun, maybe. Oh, I don't even have my levels and nimble. I am dedicated to surviving with this character. Like, seriously. That actually legitimately annoyed me that the... This is a freaking grocery store. That's like huge. Ooh, I 
I like that car. Oh my god, that is so many zombies. There's a nice little Corvette there as well. Oh my god. Yeah, I just riled up every single zombie I could, didn't I? Oh my god. Yep, I'm basically just pissing off every single zombie in it. The county, it seems like. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. We're getting better with this. Oh, come on, we can do this. Come on, we can do this. Honestly, leveling up Long Blade is not going to be a bad idea either. Yes. No. Thank you. Alright, there we go. They're just continuing to come here. Oh no. Come on. We got you. You already gave us a level of Long Blunt. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. Oh shit. As long as I don't miss my swings. This call saber is almost gone. Oh, that has me worried. We killed 207 though, so. My problem is why am I so overweight? From what? I'm that overweight because of a book of matches. It threw me that overweight. Uh, I think I need to... I have gym goers, so I could grab one of these gym contraptions because I need to build up the strength. Because that is the only thing that I'm missing is two levels in strength here. That'll help me carry things. That'll help me do a lot. So I think that is what I'm going to do. So remove the broken glass here. Come in here. Now, what is this? All right, this is not hot. Okay. All right. You know, while we're at it. Wait, what? Oh, there we are. Let's fill the canteen with water. So, I need to take advantage of this as much as possible because, as of right now, if the lights are still on right now, I need to take serious advantage of this. Alright, there's another one. Take a look at these real quick. See if we can't find anything. I will take it as a backup. I don't think I'm going to need it. Long sleeve compression shirt. Maybe. I don't know if that's going to be useful. It means anything electronics is going to be useful um, going forward because I need to rebuild my electronics and my mechanics. Oh my god, that's going to suck. It's going to suck. Um, but we're going to take one of these contraptions back. Because I do not have um, those two levels of strength. So. So what I'm going to do, first and foremost, that's 20 pounds. We can fit it in there. All right, because I want to build up that strength, so I have better carry capacity. What is... You know what, we're going to go back around front, because I have not gone in here yet. I did go in there. I completely forgot that I didn't go in there. All right. Oh, 
drive semi straight here, please. Alright, we're gonna leave that running just in case. Especially since it seems to be attracting every single zombie on the face of the planet. I don't think I. Oh, no, I didn't go in there either. Okay, um. Like, I did go in here. I actually really liked it here. I do need to look at a couple of the other things. So, like, these wires and stuff like that is not going to be bad to pick up. Maybe the hand torch, because I can tear that apart. Take the nails. The radio. Box of nails is never going to be bad to have. Wood glue never going to be bad to have. These additional nails. Yeah, I, I, I like this, like, little... I mean, there's gas cans, there's... There's like, oh, this is actually kind of neat. If you get to turn this into a base, that was pretty set off. The only entrance is here. What do we have here? Okay, just a dead body. Oh. Is there... Door? Oh, maybe not. What? Yeah, here. A butterfly knife, a one point sting? A garland. E oh my god. Wait, are these. These are sniper rifle items, aren't they? Pack of primers, gunpowder, large gun. What am I missing here? Like, is, is there something. No. Oh, we'll take those. Um, I don't know about this. Ooh, that's five things of ice cream. What? Um, where am I gonna put that so I can remember it? All right, so it's only five stack encumbrance. We'll put it in there. We'll put this in there as well. Yeah, just so I remember it. What do we have here? Oh my God. A mini MP4. What was that noise? I so thought I heard something. Box of MREs. All the same. There's, oh my god, there is a, um, a cot over there. There's a cot over there too. That's huge. That's huge. I did not have one. A military radio. More to be able to tear apart for electronics. The problem is... Oh my god. Okay. Um, yeah, we're gonna need to... Oh my god, this dude was... What the hell is this? Was this like a survivalist freaking outpost? It must have been. It must have been like a survivalist. An M16A2? Yeah, this is a survivalist outpost. Dude, that's freaking nuts. That's freaking nuts. We gotta come back here. I'm just gonna unload this whole damn thing. I want that stretcher because we don't have a bed back at the base. So I do need that stretcher. So this is actually a relatively good start. 211 zombie kills in 9 hours. Uh, I'm worried about jumping outdoors. You know what? We're gonna... Got that so nothing just goes inside. What the hell is that? <laughs> what the hell is that? Um, let's smoke this half of one cigar. All right, open up his trunk. That's only 30 space. Uh, oh my god. Alright, so these jeeps really do not have good space. I need to find a vehicle that I can actually work with. Um... What can we do here? Alright, so what I needed to do was I needed to get rid of all this. I did not want to get rid of everything, though. Um...
Please don't sneak up on me. Please don't sneak up on me. Okay. No, don't drop. The box of memories will be useful as well. Okay. There's a zombie just rolled up on me. Hi. Hi, buddy. Strike a shotgun on us. We are gonna come up here and it, I still don't think we're gonna be able to get. You know what? This is really, really close. I think what I need to do is I just need to go back, drop this vehicle off, and then I need to take another vehicle out to search for a vehicle that would be able to be like a better driving around option. Um once again, if I could find one of those prison buses, oh my god, would that be amazing. Like, I want to find a prison bus so bad. We'll go ahead and drop this off there. I think one of these vehicles, I think this vehicle is working. We'll drop off this food real quick. That is the only thing that I need to worry about right this second. Oh dear lord, we're getting close. We're getting really close on that. I want to keep the ice cream. Um, maybe the salmon. Can the chicken put in there? The chicken can put in there. Okay. So we can put that all in the freezer there. We have a decent amount of foodstuffs. Oh. Um... Let's go ahead and turn you off and just leave you there. I believe... Why am I still overweight? You're telling me I'm overweight because of a lighter. I'm going to be a little bit pissed. <laughs> I'm going to be a little bit pissed. Um, I don't need to carry the lug and jack wrench. Or the jack and lug wrench on me anymore. Um, because I don't have that mechanic level. Unfortunately, I lost all my Mason's levels, too. That actually legitimately sucks. Alright, that does put me underweight. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. I need to find... You do have a key in you, but you have no gas. Got it. Come on. Oh, can't even get to you. Um, you know, screw it. We're gonna take the other Jeep, I guess. You have those two Jeeps up there. Like, I don't think this one has anything in it, does it? Oh, it does. You know what? We're gonna take the empty gas can. We're gonna siphon some gasoline out of this. And that should give us enough to where we're going to do is put gas in this other vehicle. Because I don't give a crap about... Well, I mean, I do. I don't, but I do. You know? I'm going to try to go out and find a vehicle. I really don't like the fact that I'm going out with such low loot. What the hell? Oh! Well, shnikes. Okay. Um, as I said, like, I'm legitimately just... We're not even worried about getting other stuff. Um, I didn't expect that. I didn't expect that at all. <laughs> Alright. Ah. <sighs> Alright, worst comes to worst, if I get caught in a bad situation, I'm hoofing it back as quick as possible to this base, pulling out my shotgun and destroying like a million gazillion zombies through the wall. 
if that's what I have to do. Like, there is... The problem is there's such high populations here. Um, and you gotta think about it. I mean, I basically killed 6,000 zombies, you know, with that other character. We're gonna have a lot, lot heavier population. Alright, so... I... There, I know there's a ton of zombies over there. There's also a community college over there, which I will one day go through. Um, let's just check this out. Oh, this feels weird driving after hell days. After we're trying to get this figured out, and it just couldn't get figured out. The plus is, is I know even if the mod does corrupt the save pile, we are literally saving it after every single... After every single recording, so it shouldn't be a problem what we have up here. Oh, they're just a shit ton of zombies. Some type of warehouse, but that... Actually, that... No! <clears throat> Doesn't help me. Alright, well... Yeah, we, we took out some zombies with a car that we weren't planning on bringing back. car doesn't seem like it's in bad, that bad a condition, but I want a vehicle that I can modify. Oh my god. Okay. Um. What did I do to myself? Oh my god. That building, it's all protected. What is that? You know what? Screw it. Let's go off roading. Why is the parking lot over here? Um, an accountant building. Yeah, screw that. Um,. Warehouse. Do we have any, like, buses, anything around here? Are there any schools? I mean, the college is a school, but I don't think buses generally hang out around the colleges. I think they're only, they only hang around school schools. Try. We're pissing off every single zombie in the area, and I know we are, but. Um. Fuck you. Oh, a medical center. So bad. Nice little truck. Another medical center. Oh. We're actually out of the. Oh my god. God. Oh, wow. There are so many of them. This is leaving pit stop. Should I leave pit stop? I mean, I, I do have the, like, I have to get back there, but maybe it wouldn't be a bad thing to leave for the time being. Is it a military pit point? All these protected buildings with the protected windows throw me off. You know what? We're going to try to go over here because it looks like it comes back around and back into Pet Stop. Because I kind of want to see what we have. Alright, this is a gas station. Okay. Okay. Right here. Maybe we'll find, like, a school or something like that in the background, which will be useful. You know. I would say, like, an RV, but I don't think an RV would be useful. Along those lines, so. We'll try, we'll try, we'll try. Where are we getting to, though? I don't recognize this area at all.
Alright, get this building over here. Oh, there's just farms. Okay, so there's a residential area down here. What I can't believe is that there's no schools and there's only the college. Which makes no sense. That was actually a very low zombie population over here. Yeah, it's picking up quite a bit now that we're in the residential zone. Even though it's still not super... Oh no, I spoke too soon. It's... it's... decent. Oh shit! Come on. Don't do that crap. Just stalled in the middle of nowhere. Come on. Is there nothing? Gonna, oh, there's a bookstore. Oh shit! I don't think we're gonna get anywhere. There was a bookstore. Um, I do have the electronics. This is not going well. do that. We cannot do that. Like, in a plus side though, like, am I just pissing off every single zombie to be able to come towards me? Which might not be the worst idea. Oh, that's a freaking board up house. That's a survivor house. They didn't survive very well. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't survive very well, but that's a survivor house. Um, I don't think this car's gonna last very much longer, especially going at this rate. You know, we are like that is our base right there. So, worst comes to worst, I can run. What we got? Oh, that's that little warehouse I was talking about. Who is this? Holy, me running. Okay, um, I did not realize we had so many zombies so close to us. I mean, I, oh my god. Like, I was just over here. Unless that's the, what brought them in the area. They floated in this area because I was just over here. You know what? I have a feeling we are just going to be bringing them right back. I'm going to try something here. I'm going to try something that I think would be very, very smart. Because I know that they can they can definitely get through these fences because these are just creative fences. But those other fences are not creative fences. So they can't get through those fences. But I'm pretty sure I can shotgun them through them like I was able to do before. So if that's the case. Really? Not what I was looking to do at all. Like at all. What I want to do is I want to get up to this area. I want to pull out the MGL Stranger ship. Oh my god, how pull up. I mean, the condition is still good, so... Condition is still good. Um, I actually do want to attach that to my back. What I... There we go. I was trying to get that reinforced baseball bat out of my hand. Alright. What I'm going to do... Stupid. But let's try to get as many of those zombies over here. It looks like it's working a little bit here. Oh, yeah, there's more down here. 
one coming in here. Sorry about the noise, but yeah, here they come. All right, can we stop? Thank you. So many coming. Oh, uh, come on. Oh my god. Okay. Hi, guys. How are you? Oh, if they ever come towards the front, I'm so screwed. Oh, wow. Now, this reminds me of, like, the... The Walking Dead, when the fences are gonna go. Oh my god, are they not... I have shotgun shells on me, don't I? Did I put the shotgun... Son of a biscuit. I put the shotgun shells away. Um, there we go. There we go. Okay, that's a lot of zon... Oh my god! Okay. Let's become desensitized. Oh my god. I don't know if that's gonna actually help me. I mean, the aiming was gonna go way up. The reloading should go way up. I should really try. Do I still have that? I don't have that spear on me. I was not say, do spears work through? I forgot this is basically an auto shock. Like, I'm really glad that they can't get through these fences. This was actually really stupid of me. Maybe I need to go at an angle. Maybe it's because I'm panicking and I'm drowsy. Problem is, you can't speed up reloading. Okay. Do another thing. Come on. All right. We lost on them quite a bit. 115 zombies killed already. Damn. I did, didn't I just start this portion at 88? I just started to restart this character. And... Okay. 345. We are going to go up here because I do not know. There's a couple of them up here. Not too many. So they all kind of went to this area. We'll take you out. We'll take you out. Oh, man, I'm going to have to go through so many of these zombies. The plus is we're at 362 zombie kills. I do not know what that's going to take. Oh, that's not good. Why are there no zombies here? Did they all? No? Did I clear them out?
Oh. Apparently, I legitimately cleaned them out. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to grab that stretcher, buddy. Or the, the, no, I mean, the fitness contraption wouldn't do that either. But we need to get that stretcher, buddy. Um, where are you? There you are. So I'm going to need to read like crazy to be able to get everything done. I think this was, you know, a relatively decent day one. I'm redoing this, which sucks so much. That's right, I did that for water. Alright, so for the time being, what I'm going to do is... We're going to put our stretcher bed here. And then I'm going to get my fitness contraption out. And then for the time being, we are going to... Oh. I can't change where it is. Okay, I guess we're going to put it there. Alright. So, I need to smoke a cigarette real quick. Probably should eat. But I think what I want to do is I just want to sleep real quick. And come out the opposite side of the day. All right, it's 310 in the morning. Yay. 363 zombie kills. So we get something to eat real quick. And I'm probably going to, like, this was probably the most useless episode on the face of the planet, but I'm probably going to end this episode relatively soon. Um, because I simply just need to do looting um, of those zombies, specifically. And a lot of the kills are going to be towards, like, a desensitized perk. Like, you know what? Screw it. We're gonna... We're gonna try this a little bit more. Come on. I can't see them until they actually almost hit the fence. That's not good. That's not good. I might have attracted them from this way instead. Okay. My turrets are doing the job, though. I mean, I know what I should do is... You know what? Did we seriously just... Oh, there's a couple of them. Oh, I think what it is is the majority of them that were up there were kind of taken out. So I think what I need to do is I need to come up here and do the things. Do the deeds. Sorry once again. But this is a good way to be able to deal with them. Alright. I don't think we're gonna... Oh, no, we got a decent amount. There's a decent amount. Okay, they're coming. How uh, the fucking word work? Look at all this. Oh my god, look at all that. They're coming out of the woodwork. I should have picked up that spear to be able to see if that would work. I think that's what I'm going to do. Um, tactical sickle. The spear, I believe, is down here, right? Uh, butterfly knife. Where the hell is the spear? Survival knife. Antique bayonet. What? Is it 
still in, it's still in my freaking, I'm an idiot. All right, it's, it was still in my hands. We're gonna try this and see what we can do with this. Because this is a spear with a hunting knife. Can they go through the wall? Oh. What? Okay, that I need to be careful with. It's hitting the fence. God, I just realized there. Do you see all those like floating around out there? Okay. This reminds me more of The Walking Dead. But if I can build up spears. And not only build up spheres, but the maintenance that goes with them. Dear Lord. No, 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 no. There we go. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. I don't think that actually took any durability away from that spear either. It's pretty low in the first place, but... <laughs> Great. Well, one of these watches... There are so many zombies out there. Like, I would be really, really interested to be able to do that. Um, so what I'm going to do is, once again, getting very, very close to... You know what? I know there's a couple out there. And look at that. They're out there. Oh. Where's Zambies? I'm curious to what, I mean, maintenance is going up. The sphere's almost at a level. Damn. Oh, so spears are really, really useful. Oh, there we go. No, finally I almost went, or they went down a little bit. Um, I still think that over here is the best because they can see me better over here, right? So let's do this real quick. Once again, I apologize. I wanted to make this a relatively long episode where we killed at least 500 zombies. Try to get desensitized. Try to get everything going. Um, can we speed this up? Oh my god. Okay. Okay. That did the things. Basically, I need to speed things up a little bit. I need to get my... It's going pretty good, I will say. This spear is doing its trick. And it's not going down in... Fences are truly your friends in situations like this. There's 100% no doubt about that. They are... What the hell type of freaking... Zombies. Oh, it's an Afro pick. I'm like, what the hell type of zombie is that? Spear. Nice. You know what we're gonna do is we are gonna use the spear until it goes, right? You god don't the fence itself. Alright. 
what I need is I need levels in freaking maintenance as well. Because maintenance is way important to spears. Normally I don't use spears until I have very level high maintenance. The problem is I had like maintenance level 8 on the other character. But... Bad luck. Unlucky rubber ducky, right? Alright. That's only 439 killed. 440 killed. We're almost level 2 maintenance, we're almost level 2, or I mean, we're working on level 2 spear. Do we have... Honestly? Not very high. We're gonna go out. If I need to go back, I need to go back. But we're gonna... Oh shit. Go work on our spear. I mean, there we go. We're gonna go work on our spears out here. Because what I want to do is I want to get the zombie population around this cleared as much as possible. Damn. Okay. And I would love, like, I don't think I'm gonna get desensitized because I have it set to, like, Anywhere up to 5,000 zombie kills before it goes to desensitize, so I don't think we're gonna get there today. But honestly, not a bad start at all. Be able to get back into the hang of things. We were able to kill, you know, 100 zombies is a lot. It's a lot. Um, let me take a look. Oh my god. Um. Well, they're PTK, a Ruger, peanuts. We don't need a frying pan. Camera, ACP rounds. Alright, so normally I wouldn't. Like, I would just go through that. The problem is, I can't see behind these trees. And I could have swore I just heard a zombie. There's one up there. Got one, two, dude! I freaking love spears. Three. There's a level of maintenance. That's big. It's only maintenance level two, but oh, that is the zombie that I heard. Okay, I wasn't paranoid about that. I did hear a zombie. I did 100% hear a zombie then. Um, I think the Ruger's. Alright. Right. You know what, we're going to start taking these coins, but it's literally going to be just for show. Um, I did actually uninstall those mods because they were some of the ones that were causing problems. So I had to go through and uninstall a decent amount of mods, which sucks so much. Um... But, I think I learned a lesson that, once again, it's not only the save, it's the fact that I need to go through and... Oh, you know what, Santa suits. I'm gonna take them. Scandroid jacket. No idea what that is. Lock uh, one. one. Little holster. Dead bird. Aww. Oh. 11. Take a cigar, those chips, those cigarettes. More. I thought I just saw something. Oh, Billy Hook. That's actually going to be nice. Easy few rounds. And those alcohol wipes. And we will loot all that. That is the one mod that I want to keep on here is the being able to go through all the zombies in a pile and loot them speeding things up. Um, Alright, there are more zombies down here. Freaking 
spears, man. So good. So freaking good. Oh, this is freaking amazing. We'll take this. Oh, we can't take the 919 rounds. Um. Okay, we'll take. These coins have no weight to them, by the way. So they don't really matter whether I have them on me or not. Um, the bag of tobacco can go in there, though. The bourbon is a medical thing. This is the alcohol wipes, because I want to take this, and if I can, these. Um, I think what I need to do is I need to just focus on looting these things and kind of clearing a couple of the zombies out. I, I shouldn't care what's on them right now. Like, I legitimately should just clear zombies. These freaking... Oh my god. Other than... that a camera? Oh, it didn't have a camera. So, I think that's going to be my focus, is going to be kind of looting and getting as many kills as I possibly can to be able to get back up to at least a thousand, maybe hit desensitized, would be nice. Um, and once again, saving. Holy hell, please remember, remind me, comments, everything, remind me to save. Um, or back up the everything else. I realize the heat's making a little bit thirsty, that's... 100% fine. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Um, let's go ahead and drop in the drop boxes here. We'll just go ahead and drop in the drop boxes here. And we are going to get out of here until next episode. This is Kira Henley. And she is going to be taking over the 1,000 Days Survive Challenge. This is only one day, one hour in. So we've got a lot of time to be able to go. But as you see, there's already 457 zombies killed. I'm still planning on this survive to 1,000 days. I'm still planning on 100,000 zombie kills. Unfortunately, learn your lesson like I learned mine. Back up your character files if you're using mods. Back up your character files. Otherwise, there's going to be a corruption of a character eventually. And unfortunately, my last character... The save was corrupted on no matter what I did, no matter what I would do, the save would not save with that. So let's go ahead, make this a good one. We will see you guys again next time. Thank you so much for all the support, all the support on the shorts, all the support on 1000 Days Survived, all the support for CVDA. And we will see you guys again in the next Survive 1000 Days Challenge. Bye bye for now.